Good day everyone, welcome to video tutorials. Today, we'll continue on with the tutorial for modeling the human figure, specifically, we'll model the lower leg today. Here we have the foot we have modeled previously. So now let's click on the box button and click and drag out the box in the left viewport. Drag it out to form approximate uh, size of the lower leg. Then we click on W to select move to, click and drag it and position it properly. Set modify panel. Okay, make sure length set minus six, width set minus one, and height set minus is two. Now we right click on the box, select convert to at the poly. Change the name to leg. Click enter. Click on plus button and select vertex. Okay, now, sorry, now we select polygon. Now we, the box selected, press alternate key to enter isolation mode, then click and drag, alternate click and drag the mouse button to arch rotate. Click here, control click to select multiple polygons, then press delete to delete the polygons at the bottom of the leg, then click close to exit isolation mode. Click on the poly to exit to object mode. Now let's select this foot object. Then we press on Q to enter isolation mode. Alternate click and drag with the mouse button to arch rotate. Select polygon to enter polygon editing mode. Click, control click, control click, control rotate. Then press delete to select to delete the selected polygons. Then press close to exit isolation mode. Now let's Select edit portfolio, select the leg object, right click and select attach and then click on the foot object to attach it. Then select vertex now. Now we right click on perspective view, press alternate W to maximize current selected viewport. Alternate click and drag the middle mouse button to arch rotate, use the mouse to screw in. Press alternate X to make the selected object see through. Now we select this vertex, then click and drag. Then select this vertex, right click and select target wheel, then click and drag to wheel to move this vertex or wheel these two vertexes together from source vertex to target vertex. Okay, now you just have to repeat the previous steps of wielding, of selecting a uh, source vertex and then right click and select the target wheel and then click and drag from the source vertex to a target vertex to wheel them into a single vertex. You just have to repeat this for the appropriate vertices. Okay, now press alternate W to go back to the four viewports view. Now we right click on left viewport, press alternate W to maximize the current viewport. Select the object, click on modify panel, make sure the vertex Anything more is selected, then click and drag to select this, then press W to select move to, click and drag to move this vertex, set the vertex down. And now you repeat the previous set of actions, by that is by selecting a appropriate set of vertices, then moving them to the appropriate position so that they more closely, so that the model will more closely resemble the reference image in the left viewport.